Hi everyone, it's Katie here. I know I've not been posting a whole lot on my YouTube channel. Really haven't had a lot to post. Really haven't been able to. Had times, sometimes not my friend. But I felt the need to vlog this. My experience with glasses.com. I know probably you're thinking, oh no, she had a horrible experience. That could not be further from the truth. It started with, I was supposed to get my glasses today and that didn't happen. And I've been watching the tracking information and noticed that I hadn't gotten anything since it left the sorting facility in Salt Lake City, Utah. So I started out calling DHL. I, I have to say DHL's phone line could be better, but uh, that's neither here nor there. It's when I got to the finish. Well, let me let me get my thoughts reorganized here. I called DHL. DHL told me that I gave them my number, the, the tracking number, and they couldn't find any information on it. Weird. Then I told them that I'd been getting information on it, and then it suddenly stopped around Salt Lake City on the 25th of this month. September and they're like that's not right that shouldn't have happened because they were getting no more information they were getting the same thing I was which was the last known location with Salt Lake City was it was leaving the sorting facility in Salt Lake City so it was determined that they were lost somewhere in Salt Lake City weird especially since I live nowhere near Salt Lake City and they don't understand why UPS got it all the way in Salt Lake City, which they should have given it to UPS here in Houston, where I live. The, the sorting facility in Houston. The UPS sorting facility in Houston, not the UPS sorting facility in Salt Lake City. Meaning, something wrong here. Hmm, something screwy. Yeah, it was lost. So they direct, redirect me to call glasses.com. This is where my experience went from meh to spectacular. I called glasses.com, of course, expecting to get a computer. Instantly, I get a live person. One of the nicest, very, very nice man answered the phone. And we talked. He apologized, very, very sincerely apologized for what happened, that my glasses were lost. And not only... Are they being reshipped, new pair? But because of my experience of them being lost, they graciously upgraded my shipping to priority next day shipping. To next day shipping free of charge. So I'm paying just the amount for my glasses, which is 139 US, and I'm getting next day shipping free because circumstances beyond my control caused me to not get them. Circumstances beyond anyone's control caused me not to get my glasses. So now, as of the prices with free lenses, free to cheap lenses, depending on your prescription and if you've got bifocals or not. Actually, no, prescription doesn't matter unless you have bifocals or trifocals. Or something like that. The single vision, which is what I have, their lenses start out at free, and then I believe the most expensive lenses are like 80 bucks, something like that, 80, 90 bucks. When the same lens, comparable lenses at like Vision Works and Walmart can be upwards of $200. Like, I'll use polycarbonate because that's the only one I can think of offhand. Polycarbonate and Vision Works, you're going to pay upwards of $200 for a set of polycarbonate lenses. Set of polycarbonate lenses at glasses.com, you're paying roughly 80 bucks. Less than 80 bucks. 79 bucks. I'm calling it 80, rounding it up. But it's $79 for a pair of polycarbonate lenses. And during the back to school times, children's glasses, they will upgrade to polycarbonate lenses at no additional charge. And I thought, 
oh my gosh, that's absolutely awesome. And I've been recommending it them around the church, my church, Memorial Baptist in Pasadena, and around, just around my friends to those who wear glasses. Thinking, if I can help one person save a little money, that's great, because this is a great company. And my experience with their customer service only reinforced what I already knew is that they're a good company. And so, those of you in the U.S., I'm not sure if it's even available in Canada. The service is available even in Canada because I'm so far south. My odds of meeting someone from Canada is minuscule at best. So, if you're watching this in Canada, please comment below and tell me if, it's, if you have glasses.com in Canada. And anywhere else, if you have a service similar to that, comment down below and let me know. Or if you wish you did, just, just say something down below. It's I want to hear from you guys. I want to hear if anyone's watching this and what y'all have to say about it. But yeah, that that's just what I had to say. All I had to say. Thank you for watching. Thank you for taking the time to watch this crazy vlog if you watched it. And yeah, this is my experience. This is what I wanted to say. Thank you. Bye-bye.